Welcome back to Andy's Guides. In today's video, we are going to show you how to sync Trello with Google Calendar. Let's begin. Now, the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials. If this is your first time here in Google Calendar, I need you to click the sign up option. And from here, just follow the on screen instructions and you're good to go. Syncing Trello with Google Calendar can help you track of deadlines, tasks, and events by viewing your Trello cards directly within your Google Calendar. All right. Now, there are multiple ways for you to be able to sync or integrate these two platforms. Number one is just hover to the power up section, click the add power ups. And from here, let's search for the Google Calendar. Okay, so here is going to be, you have two options. You have the Google Calendar. Let me just, um, the one is adding Google Calendar Sync and the, one, the other is Google Calendar plus Trello two-way sync. All right, so what I'm going to do is add both, but for now, let's click on the uh, Google Calendar plus Trello two-way sync. Click add because from here you can sync cards, events, boards, and a lot more. Let's click on that. And of course, all we're going to do is click on add and we're going to authorize both of these platforms. Hover down below. And as you can see, we're already done. Click on settings. You might want to check some of the uh, settings that they wanted. And that's that. Now, I want you to go back to the add power ups again. Hold on. Sorry for that. I'm going to look for the calendar again because we wanted to have the uh, Google Calendar only. This one, you can sync your Trello boards and cards with dates to Google Calendar. I want you to click on it. I want you to click on add. Once it's added, you see it's free. You can connect your Trello board to Google Calendar and never miss a deadline. Click on settings, authorize account. Of course, all they're going to do is follow the on-screen prompts. Just like that. And click on allow. You see? Now, you have this option. You can view the Google Calendar in Trello and sync Trello cards with Google events or both. All they're going to do is click on the start button. All right. Now, for the Google account, you might want to um, sign in on that. I'm going to do that right now. And as you can see, you can have all of the options. You can view and edit events on your calendar, see and download any calendar you can access, or you might want to click on select all and click on continue. All right. When you sign in, the next thing is select a calendar for example this one i'm going to be using that one okay click on next now you have two options you can use the one way to google calendar or two way or one way to trello it's all up to you but the thing is you can keep in sync if check the cards will be kept in sync with the events in the google calendar all right later we will go to the google calendar to see on how we can check the events that is going towards the trello if checked, Google Calendar events will be created for the existing Trello cards that have a start and due date in future set. I want you to click on save. All right. You can also add new if you wanted, but I'm not going to do that because I believe that's that. You can also, again, if you wanted to upgrade to a... Uh, Another plan you might want to do so, but for now, let's go to the basic. All right, click that and let's go back to the cards right here. For example, this one, this is the task that you wanted. You see the dates has been already added here. All right, now I'm going to switch to the calendar. Now, as you can see, we have already added the how to sync Trello with Google Calendar, right? September. And of course, you can send this link to the people that you wanted to be a part of this event. All right now the next option is using zapier basically we have so many tutorials about zapier automations now you can simply connect trello to google calendar and automate the work by connecting these apps click this orange button and you can have all this endless possibilities 
If I do that, what will happen is he would be forwarded here. The, we're going to rename the app. Now, for the Trello, you see, all they're going to do is choose an event. For example, it triggers when a card is archived in Trello or triggers when a card is moved to a list in Trello inside the same board. All right. But for now, I'm going to do this. Um, triggers at a specified time before a card is issued. I'm going to click that. And go to Google Calendar and this, you can choose an event. For example, it creates a new calendar or it invites one of more person to an existing event. I'm going to choose, I think, create a calendar to, allow, to make it easier. All I'm going to do is click this continue button. Of course, you need to sign in. Once I do that, click on allow and just follow the on-screen prompts. Okay, that's that. Click on continue. Of course, you can enter the uh, text. For example, this one. All right. Now click this button to complete this step. You can test your trigger. Click this button to see if that works. All right. You see that one? Basically, what happened is you can customize how you want to sync to work such as thinking only specific boards or list all right of course you can set the conditions for which cards get sync and deciding whether changes in google calendar should also update trello cards but again uh, my suggestion is once configured you need to activate the workflow to start syncing trello with google calendar automatically all right and of course by doing that you can if you need to sync cards from multiple trello boards you'll need to repeat the process for each board or maybe you can use a third-party tool to manage them all in one place. But of course, syncing for Trello with Google Calendar is a great way to keep tasks and deadlines organized, providing you with a consolidated view of your schedule across platforms. Now, the last form that I'm going to show you is using Unido. And for here, you can keep Google Calendar, Calendar and Trello in sync with Unido. All right, it's easy to set up. I have done this multiple times in the past. You can start syncing in minutes. For example, when an event is found in Google Calendar, it creates a card and keeps both in sync. Now, when a card is found in Trello, of course, it can create an event in Google Calendar and keep both in sync. And all they're going to do is try it for free and then just follow the on-screen instructions. All right. And of course, syncing Trello with Google Calendar can help you keep track of deadlines, tasks and events by viewing your Trello cards directly within your google calendar thank you so much for watching we will see you again in the next video